is to come. That's Cosmo first. Uh, let's move on. Here's a CNBC TV 18 exclusive. Sources tell us that the insurance regulator is considering amending the investment regulations for private equity players. Yash, my colleague, is here to give us the latest on that. Yash, over to you. Well, quite recently, the insurance regulator IRDAI has made a series of regulatory amendments to make it easier for insurance companies to operate. And now what we are told by our sources is that the insurance regulator is looking at attracting more and more investments into the Indian insurance sector and specifically foreign investments. What we've been told by our sources is that the insurance regulator has reached out to various large global private equity players, asking them for suggestions in terms of the regulatory changes which are required, which will help them in invest in the Indian insurance sector. Specifically, there are two important things which as per our sources IRDAI is looking at. First one is essentially relaxing or removing the condition that private equity players can only invest through a special purpose vehicle or SPV. Now what we've been given to understand is that this uh, rule of only being able to invest through SPV could be removed uh, and essentially it will apply on only certain private equity players. Many private equity players could be exempted from this rule after which they'll be able to invest directly into Indian insurance companies. How will it be decided? Essentially three important things. One is the track record of the private equity player. One is the size of that private equity player. And the third one is how fit and proper that private equity player is. Based on these certain parameters, exemptions could be given to private equity players to invest directly in the Indian insurance sector. Second thing, uh, as far as the lock-in period is concerned, more than 10% of investments coming through private equity players have a lock-in of five years. This rule could be relaxed further. The lock-in period could be reduced. That's the consideration which the insurance regulator is also moving ahead with. Okay, all right, uh, Yash, thanks very much.